everyone, we're back. My name is Miss Cry Tanager, and I am playing some Silent Hill 4. I guess I gotta wait to heal up. <laughs> Wee! Okay, so I have two pieces of paper I gotta shove underneath that door. And I've got a key. I've got a key ring and a separate key, which I can't really tell what... Yes, I know, but I want to see the description. There we go. 106. Okay, so I've got the key to 106, and I've got the keys to each apartment in the building, except I assume 106, because we have the key to that separate. And 303 is missing, so I assume our entire shtick is going to be finding room 303's key. There's still blood in the sink. And by sink, I mean tub. I'm just... I'm just wasting time because I didn't realize I was actually uh, down on health a bit. Might as well be full up on health before I go through, you know, creepy holes. Because creepy holes are bad. We don't like them. We don't want them. Zoom. Okay. Jeez. I forgot about this stupid... Okay. I forgot about the, um, thing. Use the apartment keys. Ghost? Jesus Christ! I can hear it. I think. Oh, no, no, it's just these guys. Never mind. Just, just leave me alone! I gotta stomp on stuff, okay? I stab. Rude. I stab. I stab. I stomp. I stomp. Shut up! I hear you! It's difficult to tell, like, where it's actually coming from. The world is up at that wall. Okay. So, obviously not in here. Yeah, not in here. So that's this room cleared out, as far as I know. With the ghost still being as annoying as fuck. Seriously, I dread whenever a ghost shows up. Because they are... mucho annoying. Is there anything in the fridge? No. I... Door's locked. You can't go that way. Nothing in this apartment either. It looks like, yep. Okay, nothing in here. <laughs> Next. One of these has to have something in it. Locked. 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 <laughs> Upturn tables, leeches, lots of leeches. I got them out. Seems clear. Is there another door at the end? Okay, there's one more. One more door. Oh! It's a model gun totally uses as a weapon. Take it anyway? Like, maybe it needs to be used for- GOD DAMN IT! FUCKING GHOSTS! You guys are some of the most annoying sons of bitches! Hi, annoying fuckwad! Oh no, you're stabbing me! And some of the guns here are just models- Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything here that's useful, so fuck it, I'm out! Ah, so annoying. Okay. This game's good. Don't get me wrong. But the fact that the, do that the ghosts are such bullet sponges. And you can't even... It doesn't even seem like you can even temporarily put them down without a sword thingy. Makes them super annoying. Okay, I don't think I finished clearing out this area because I still have the 106 key. Sup, bitch. 
Wait, what? Why do I still have the key? Hold up. Hey, fuck. Rude. Rude. Well, can't do anything there. I'm out. I don't know why I still have this key, then. Because I still have the 106 key. Locked. There's still a ghost in here because of course there is. I can't have nice things. Sup? Come here. God, I hate you so much. <laughs> hey, ghost. How you doing? Leave me alone. I gotta go heal in my room. <laughs> Seeing is dealing with your dumb ass. It's taking away a chunk of my- WHERE IS IT COMING FROM?! So I saw- so I was looking through the inventory again, I saw that it's not an actual key key, it's a locker key! So maybe it goes to here. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I love you, Rachel. Mike. It's filled with love letters from Mike to Rachel. Okay. Guess I might as well go looking at the next floor then. Still gotta find the room- the key to room 303 so we can save Eileen. Save my girl. Okay. Doesn't seem to be anything in here. As long as there's not any fucking ghosts. This is actually a clean apartment for being in a hell world. Oh, fuck off. I hate the ghosts. I hate them. 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 Is there a ghost in here now? God damn it. There's a torn red paper in the pocket. Good to know. Yeah, that tracks. I'm out. <laughs> hey, asshole. Stupid ghosts. Oh, shit. <laughs> Yes, please, get rid of it. There's no one here. Don't, don't care. Pick it. Okay. Uh. I. There's a painting of two adults and a lot of children. The memo says 206. How can they even sleep with so many noisy kids? Besides that, they have to live next to Brain Tree. <laughs> Rude. There's a painting of a nurse on the memo says 106. My beautiful darling. Lately, she's been bothered by a stalker. Oh! Okay. So the Mike guy or Mark guy or whatever must be the stalker. And this is the room of the actual boyfriend? I don't know. A painting of a man holding a brush. And then it says 202. Self-portrait. So he's a painter and he painted everybody in the apartment in the apartment complex. A painting of a dumb man of 107. He listens to great music, but I feel sorry for himself to live under brain tree. <laughs> Nobody likes brain tree. <laughs> Painting of a plump woman. It says 204. She was always eating something. I wish my girlfriend liked to cook like her. Wow. 304. A nice, sweet old couple. Aw, that's sweet. Painting of a woman holding a cat. 102. She loved cats too much and missed her chance to get married. Wow. I'm gonna feel sorry for her while she's mourning for one of her dead cats. Aw, poor kitty. Okay. Is there anything important in here? Okay, yeah, so there's one of each. McDooter. There's a bed. I don't see nothing. What was the point of all that? Okay, 105. This must be the superintendent. The Michael's Richards level. A uh, man with a gun. Ugh. Uh. Richard Braintree, fuck this guy. There's nothing painted yet. Painting of a man drinking alcohol, 203. Does he not have one for 303 or 302? I would have thought he would have. Oh well, I'm out. The entire ghost shit seemed useless. Sup? How you doing? I don't know why that was... Oh, fuck's sake! 
Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone, you shit. What's up? Don't see anything of use in here. So... I believe that's the second floor done. Stupid ghost. Just <laughs> getting in my way and shit. Still gotta find the damn key. Oh fuck right off. Please no ghosts. What are you looking at? I hear a ghost. This cat say up is skinned Mike. Ugh. Like listen to the stereo in my room. Sure? This seems like a really bad idea. Oh yeah. Fucking ghosts! Hi, shithead. <laughs> what? Why did the door hurt me? Why did the door hurt me? Like, that's what I wanted. Why the fuck the door hurt me? What's that sound? What the fuck? Oh shit, hi, how you doing? Oh, this must be the the couple with the bunch of kids because uh bunk beds, I assume. Stupid puppo. Is there anything useful? Oh shit, puppy. How you doing? <laughs> you die now. I stab you. Uh, it's random as soon as we feel sick. Okay. No, don't step on him again. <laughs> One of these apartments has got to have something. No. <laughs> oh, fuck right off. Stupid puppas. <laughs> okay. Blood. Hi. Um. Can I take this gun? Oh shit, this is Richard Braintree's place. It's maximum six bullets, easy to use with moderate stopping power. So is it better than my other gun? Nope. What were you looking at, bruh? I see Eileen. He was staring at Eileen. Great. What's she doing in this world? Uh, about to get Shrekt, obviously. Is there anything interesting? I can't hold anymore. Oh, it's a golf club. <laughs> it's like, what do you mean you can't hold anymore? <laughs> Fucking papas. Leave me alone! <laughs> Leave me alone, shithead. <laughs> Fucking dogs. <laughs> I'm out! Okay. I'll have room for some more stuff once I put those, uh... Still not picking up that damn thing unless I have to. <laughs> not doing it! Okay, this is the place with... 302 and 303. So let's try the other side first. Oh wait, there's no other side. Never mind. <laughs> wait a minute. Can I open? Can I open 302 from this side? Is that a? Is that going to be a thing? Uh. Oh, bullets. Yeah, I can't pick that up. Anything useful? A Bible. That is not useful. At least I assume that's a Bible. <laughs> oh, tea! Tea is always useful. Puppos! Puppos are always useful. Puppos and tea. Two very useful things. Wait a minute. Oh, it's just a ketchup bottle. Very high quality ketchup bottle. Okay. So that's where Eileen's at. 
That's my room. It is kind of weird that it's the only one that's not mucky on the outside. Okay, put the red paper under the door. Torn red paper under the door. Let's go check this other room and then see if we can maybe open 302 from this side. Because it, I assume we have the key for it. Oh wait, no, I was already able to open this one. Fuck you! <laughs> I was already able to open that one. Can I open it with the key? I think it's locked from the inside too. Of course it is. And I don't have 3 0. Whatever. Yeah. Start banging on the door. Eileen! You're in danger! I'm still not picking up the damn doll unless I have to. I have learned in the trials and tribulations of Horrigans to never take a gift from an antagonist. Unless the game makes you take the gift from the antagonist, and thus far it has not made me take the gift from the antagonist, and the antagonist, so I'm not gonna take the gift from the antagonist. herp a derp a derp 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 derpy Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, let's listen to this skinned mic thing. I guess. Where's this cassette player? Is it this one? Shit. That made me jump. You put the skinned mic cassette in stereo. How do you like that, you sick little freak? You had it coming to you. Clothes are disgusting. Get them out of my sight. I know. It'll be perfect to wrap this body in. Hold it. You! Hold it. I think you I'm snooping around again? Myself. Get your ass out Hold of here before it. you Hold really it. piss me Hold off. It. Hold it. Hold it. I think I'll keep that one for myself. Hold it. I think I'll keep that one for myself. What? So, did they skin the stalker alive? The nurse and her boyfriend? Did they skin the stalker alive? That, that's what I'm getting from that. <laughs> it's kind of fucked up. I picked up the key that Eileen from room 303 must have dropped. I thought I'd return it, but she wasn't home. I guess I'll give it to the super. May 20th. Okay, so that means that Joseph Schreiber had has Eileen's key. I lost the key to Eileen Galvin's room. I've got to find it and bring it back. Let me think. The last place I saw it was... It's up here and I can't read the rest. So it's got to be somewhere in this apartment then. Is it here? No. Is it here? No. Is it here? No. <laughs> Is it here? No. Is it... In here? No. I mean, I haven't looked, but... <laughs> There's just blood. Take field of the oil. I... I'm gonna go with no. Gonna be in his bedroom closet. Can't check these. Wait, wait. There's some kind of ancient native religion still exists. Okay. There's scraps of magazine articles, but I can't remember what magazines I got them out from. Okay. Can't open the window, blah, 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 blah. Nah, that's not gonna help. <laughs> Wait, wait. I, I saw some. Maybe it was orphanage from the forest. But there's a person who's somewhere in this photo, too. Okay. You check under the bed, bro? Like, the key's gotta be in this an apartment somewhere. 
Not sure. Okay, now I'm not sure where to go. Guess I'm gonna have to go look at all the rooms again. I started going around checking all of the fridges. Because I don't think I checked all the refrigerators. It's the only thing I can think of. It smells terrible. Will you open it up? Oh, I can actually open this one. Um, it's wrapped up in these torn bloody jeans. It's the body of a dead cat! What? <laughs> There's a torn paper in one of the pockets. But why? Okay. Uh... I guess I gotta go put that underneath my door. Uh, now we have dead cats. I can deal with dead people. I can deal with dead children. I can even deal with dead babies. But don't you dare go around killing cats. Or bunnies. Or chinchillas. Or we're gonna have to have a discussion. That is where I draw the line. I should probably have drawn the line of dead children. The fuck? Is Eileen banging on her door? Uh. Use? God, sometimes I forget how to use things. <laughs> Okay. I also need to empty my inventory. So Eileen's banging on her door. I gotta go all the way back down to take a little freaking hole. Great. This is, I'm still not gonna pick up that doll. Cause something makes me think I'm nearing the end of this area. Unless it's gonna make me pick up the doll. I don't wanna pick up the doll! Don't make me pick up the doll. Don't do it. Please game. Please. It seems a very silent hilly thing to do to have something bad happen if I pick up the doll. Or it could be something good. Cause cause remember the perf the perfume in I can't remember if it was silent hill two or three. But there's a perfume item you can pick up, and I think it has a benefit and a detriment. I can't remember exactly what they are. I think it makes like one enemy weaker but one enemy stronger or something. Or maybe it just makes more enemies. I can't remember. But that's what I'm thinking. That's what I'm thinking about that doll. Because it's not making me pick up the doll. Yet. I might have to pick up the doll though. Eileen's banging on our door. You white bruh? Eileen? Honey? She's been having a hard time. Is a torn red paper. Oh yeah, I had a really wicked headache that day and just collapsed on the bed. Maybe if I look at near the bed in my room, 302's room, I'll find it. I get headaches every day now. It's terrible. What am I going to do? Okay. Look. Oh, look near the bed. I swear to God. <laughs> Did I not say check under the bed? Did I not say check under the bed? <laughs> the game was stopping you from getting the key too early. Red diary said under my bed. Then check it. Then check it, you fuck. Yep, there it is. Did I not say? Did I not say? It's kind of weird that I haven't had a boss fight yet. Well, I assume I'm not going to need that key. I'm going to need that. Don't need that. It does seem kind of... I assume it takes pistol ammunition. Because it's a revolver. It's moderate stopping power, but not much stopping power. Okay, we'll put away that gun. And I'll take and I'll take Richard's revolver. And... Yeah, let's go. Let's get out of here. We gotta go get Eileen. I got the key. I got the key, gotta go save my girl, who I don't know if I've really actually met yet. Like, I, d I don't know if prior to the shenanigans of Henry getting locked in his own apartment, um, 
if he actually met Eileen. Like, they've obviously seen each other around the apartment before that. But did he actually, like, introduce himself to and meet her? Got the key. Gotta go get it. Eileen, I'm coming, baby! I got you! I got you, my girl! Oh shit. <laughs> it's too late, bruh! Oh, it's too late! <laughs> oh, it's hella too late! Two oh one two one or twenty one wait twenty dash twenty oh no I'm twenty one aren't I? I can't. Thanks. Thanks. Did you find your mommy? This place. It's dangerous. You need to hurry. Get out of here. It's kind of fucked up that he carved into her back like that. Well, shit. Why did he thank the kid, though? Because, I mean, the kid's pretty- kind of sort of the one that did that? I mean, I assume it's the adult Walter Sullivan and that's the kid Walter Sullivan? Welp. You done goofed, Henry. You didn't go fast enough! <laughs> you should've just looked under your bed when I fucking told you to! <laughs> If you had looked under your bed when I fucking told you to, you would have gotten there before Walter got to her. I kind of wonder how, why it took Walter so long to get into the apartment. Uh. You right, Henry? This is different. We're 21. We're his final victim. <laughs> ah, shit. <sighs> Can I see her apartment from here? Oh, shit. Wait. She. Right, cause I I know I know she's not dead, cause I know she's an escort mission for the second half of the game. Are you yearning for that special place to spend quality time with your loved one? Do you need to relax and get away from it all? Come to Silent Hill for the ultimate... No. <laughs> no. Oh shit, paper! So they just oh you fucker! Oh Robbie, you fucker! <laughs> There was never any other rounds but one, my friend. Robbie's always a creeper. Again! Yeah. I mean, I know cops and the police are freaking useless, but y'all, y'all should be able to understand just logical deduction that it's not 20121, it's 20-21. Like, it's pretty fucking obvious. Walter just has terrible penmanship. There's some kind of strange paper stuck in your way. Take it, yes. Succubus! How is Eileen the succubus? <laughs> I would have th thought the succubus would have been Cynthia. I mean, she's got the temptation placard. I mean, I guess it could be like 
seducing Walter away from the path of evil or something. I don't know. I don't think I can protect myself. He's truly insane. I can't hold on any longer. His power can't be measured. I was so scared today that I sealed off the back of the storage room. What? I wonder if Eileen Galvin is okay. She has no clue what's going on. But she's in danger nevertheless. July 13th. Obviously. Okay. That is going to be it for this video, guys. My name is Scarlet Tanager and I have been playing some Silent Hill 4. I'll see you all in the next video.